Picture this. It's late January. The semester is just a few weeks old. Students are still excited to learn and you're still excited to teach. Suddenly, Mother Nature decides to flex her muscles and overnight she dumps two feet of snow on Kalamazoo. Yay! I mean, oh no, snow day. Class was going great. Students were attending, the material was sinking in, but now classes are canceled indefinitely. Pop quiz hotshot, what do you do? While your colleagues are panicking, wondering how they'll catch up once classes resume, you've got your fuzzy slippers on, you're sipping cocoa from your favorite mug, and you're resting easy. You use Panopto. Panopto is an application that instructors can use to record, manage, and host videos of their lectures. These videos can be accessed by students via Moodle or Canvas. Lecture captures can be used to provide supplemental resources for students, offer emergency backup lectures for snow days or whenever a student can attend, and allow for students to go back over tricky topics as many times as they need. So, how does it work? From your Canvas course, you will find the settings link in the course navigation menu. On the next page, you will choose the Navigation tab. Scroll down until you see Panopto video and drag it up to the top section. Click Save. You can click on the Panopto video link now. From this page, you can choose to create a new session or upload a pre-existing session. Let's record a new session. Panopto and Canvas combine to create a default folder for your session. It is the name of the course. You can, however, choose to create a new folder or record the session in a different folder. You can choose your video and audio input and select a quality level. You can also choose to capture a PowerPoint or your computer's main screen. This is a test session. You can see that the audio is recording by the speaker icon here. When you are done, you can stop. You see that the recording is complete. You can give it a description if you want. Next, I'll show you how to add a Panopto video to a Canvas page. Navigate to a Canvas page and then find the edit button. Find where you want to insert your Panopto video Make sure your cursor is where you want your video to be located. And then find the Panopto button in the toolbar. Mine is hidden in the More External Tools. Select the appropriate video. You can change certain video settings, such as the video size, or you can choose to start the video at a specific location. When you are happy with the settings, click the Insert button. The video loads, and then you can save. You can see the video is now part of the Canvas page. In this video, we cover the benefits of using Panopto and went over the steps on how to include Panopto in a Canvas page. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more Canvas introduction and training videos from your very own KVCC Faculty Success Center.